In this video, I'll show you how to put an object behind another object in Photoshop. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like. And let's get right into this guide. I want to go and put the Photoshop logo behind the first part of the box so it looks like it's coming out of the box, if that makes sense. So let's go and do this. So firstly, what you want to do, just go and hide the other layer, which you want to go and put behind it. So I'm gonna go and hide the Photoshop logo, just like so. And go and select the layer, which you want to go and put the object behind like this. Then what you need to do is go over to the left-hand side like so, and where you've got the selection tool, which is the fourth option down, you need to hold your left mouse button on it, and you need to go and select the object selection tool. Alternatively, you just press W. Then what we need to do is go and select the object. So I want to go and select this here. So let me just go and select it. I just want to do this front half of the box. So the logo is still in front of the other part though. And then go and let go once it's all selected like this and give it a moment. And now that's gone and actually selected it perfectly. However, if it hasn't, then what I recommend doing is going over to the left hand side, going down to the selection tool again. So press W or just the fourth option down. And then what you can do, use is a quick selection tool like this. And then if you want to go and remove apart from the selection, then what you need to do is hold Alt. And then what you can do is go and click. And what you can do is then go and remove parts as you can see, just go and click and it's gonna go and remove it like this. And if you want to go and add anything, then you just press shift and you can then go and add it back just like this. However, mine is already perfect, so I don't need to remove or add anything. So then once you're ready, all you then need to do is make sure the selection tool is still selected like mine is now and right click in the area. And then what we need to do is go down to layer via copy and tap there. Then what it's going to go and do is gonna go and duplicate the part we just went and selected. So now it's selected, I can go and drag it. And as you can see, I'm now moving the box. So then what we need to do is go and find the object which you want to go and put behind. So in this case, it's the Photoshop logo. So I'm gonna go and make it visible on the in the in the bottom right in the layers tab. Then go and drag it below the layer we just went and copied like so. And as you can see, it now looks like the Photoshop logo is coming outside of the box. And I'm just gonna go and resize it by pressing Control and T and make it a little bit smaller. And that is perfect. And that's it guys. I've now gone and made it look like the logo is coming out of the box because I went and put it behind it. If you guys found this useful, then please consider leaving a like. Peace.